Hey everybody out there. Uh, sorry for the delay in video. Uh, but, uh, well, you saw from my last visit, or from my last video, that we've had some problems here. We're up and running fully now. It's been a couple of days since we've been on, but uh, just haven't gotten around to doing some stuff. So, And I haven't done a how-to video in a while, so I'm going to uh, give you guys a little tip on how I'm doing the uh, the barbed wire on my jails and I mean right now you're just looking at my hands but I'm gonna show you this uh, this stuff I got from Home Depot it's uh, it's just a, it's like chicken wire fencing I, I think that's the terminology it's a little expensive because I bought it in like a big roll um, but if you're you know if you're gonna do fencing in the future you might as well go with it and stuff like that uh, but what I've done is uh, so this is how I get to my um, how I do my barbed wire on the building uh, so what I do is I see you see over here the uh, you'll have these sections here okay uh, I hope I can get this really good guys um, sorry for the lighting and all that stuff but you can see uh, just up here so you want this section on the top of this one okay and even if it's in the middle right you want to cut the tops and the bottoms all right and you just want to be left with the straight long piece and some of the bits that are left on from from when you cut it all right um, so what what you do is basically just get like uh, wire cutters and you want to snip and just keep snipping uh, until you get to the very end I'm not gonna go all the way to the end I'll just cut it off and show you what it looks like um, that should be good enough so I'll cut a section off <clears throat> and some of these areas are a little bit bigger but you'll get the picture uh, and then right there so this is what you got um, and it's the idea is to give it the optical illusion of uh, barbed wire and you know from barb uh, the regular barbed wires is it goes you know an area of barb straight barb straight barb straight barb so it's giving it that um, um, illusion so it's giving it that illusion okay um, so what I've done is I've, I've made some real long ones, I've cut the real, real long ones, as you can see, and they're basically the same thing, just a little bit more, um, you know, cut up and more equal and stuff like that. Uh, and then uh, what I do is I'll take the building <coughs> and the beginning of it is you just want to get the building you want to glue the one section over here glue that down and work it the same way with all the other ones you're going to do two areas so this area right here will end up looking uh sorry so it'll end up looking like that and that's your two um areas or two sections of the barbed wire uh, from a distance and you know the scale ratio to the building this will look just like uh, barbed wire um, without really even doing too much work so that's how I do it um, the glue that I leave behind I've got it on a high setting because it's going from wood you know, so it's uh, these are just toothpicks that I've cut off and edged uh, it'll be painted in the end, so these will all be painted uh, like aluminum or that kind of color. Uh, these are all the same level, so they all go into the same level. And the thing is that you're going to want to come around when you do corners. All you do is just glue it on that section, make a bend so it can go to the same uh, distance on the other one. And then you just work your way all the way around the building. 
Um, afterwards, you can come in here with a knife or um, uh, I use uh, I use these things, and I'll go in and I'll you know clean up the glue area uh, and make it look good. Okay, I'm just leaving in just leaving on enough. Uh, glue to make it look good so that's how I do that and I'm gonna get back to work on this one uh, well if you're seeing this video the uh, yeah, let's do this. <coughs> uh, uh, there we go there we go all right so well um, if you're watching this that's pretty much it for the building I've got everything all done. It's all, and you can see over here, uh, it's all prepped out, all ready to be packaged. Um, if you can see that, this is the, the water tanks, but I've got uh, fencing with, uh, you can see that kind of barbed wire around it. And I did the same thing but I uh, just the straight long pieces I just put those around um, a, uh, a brush a, a small brush and twirled it around pulled it out and then stretched the ends and that's how I came up with that uh, looks pretty cool well, uh, but anyways the uh, all those sections that's all done it just needs to get painted a little bit um, and let's see so we get that that building that building that one uh, the bridges and all the good stuff over there uh, the jail that's all done just a little bit of touch up painting on the inside I put three levels of highlight when you when it gets down to you if you want you know you can you know, do your own highlighting and stuff but uh, you know, I did did the three levels so let's get that like uh, old looking uh, concrete stuff uh, oh and you know what just because you're awesome well I got I made you a that wall section well I think I, I've seen you've seen it before but I finished up the wall section and uh, I'm going to paint those uh, steel color so it's all done and oh, actually if you take a walk with me Ooh. darkness light sorry guys I just had to go into my bedroom I'm back in here to my room and this is the last thing I'm gonna cut it afterwards all right here's the power plant Tell me what you think, okay? Um, if you want me to change the scheme, I'll change the scheme. Uh, whatever you want. The that up on the top is not just all black; it's uh, brown and black. Um, but again, it's you can change the color if you want. Um, I uh, printed out some um, some of these uh, caution uh, things. Some forty uh, k. Um, whatever they are, designs or whatever. Um, and then I just shrunk them down to this size and uh, put it on. Uh, and that's it. So that piece goes up here. And that's going to be your power generator building. All right. So uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the tip. I'll probably post up a couple of more before I send this bad boy out, but uh, pretty much it's all done. And I'm thinking by Monday when the uh, when the um, uh, what do they call that place that mails things? Oh yeah, the post office. Uh, when that opens up on Monday, I'll be uh, shipping it out, and uh, I'll send you a private message. Well, just uh, work out the details, okay? 
all right folks so that's it and uh, i'll be talking to you guys soon uh, so until then take care